What is up, Roll Gamers? Welcome to El Salvador vs. Virginia. This is another versus that has been requested for a long time, so I'm finally doing it today and making that person happy since, you know, they requested it for a long time. Uh, first things first, if you missed the stream of World Annexation Part 70, I actually invade China in that part. Instead of taking out Vietnam, I found out that I have treaties with them. I opted for invading mainland China and Thus, I did that and made a lot of progress in that stream. So if you missed that, link below. I also finally made an outro. I wanted to do a new intro, but instead, you know what? I decided to put it as an outro. It's anime based, by the way. But at the end of my videos now, there's going to be an outro no. Outro, outro no? Outro now that says thanks for watching. And also, of course, please subscribe and like. So, I decided to put it as an outro instead of creating a new intro. I'll keep the intro that TM Bro has created. Again, thanks, mate, for that. Even though it's loud, I like it, and so does everyone else. So, El Salvador vs. Virginia. This is my second time playing as El Salvador, actually. I did it against Honduras a long time ago. I forgot if I got a victory out of that. I don't remember. Maybe I did. I don't know. Gotta check back on my playlist. But, uh... This is like my fourth or fifth time trying to take out my home state of Virginia. I don't know why everyone tries to get a versus against my home state. Why? You know what? Next time I might do it my own versus as Virginia. I think I've only played as Virginia once. Yeah, I did only one versus as my state. So you know what? Maybe next time I'll do a versus for myself as Virginia against whoever my opponent is. But this is like my fourth or fifth time trying to take Virginia. So let's see if a Central American country can actually take a U.S. state. So this will be interesting. And I'm curious to see what happens from there on. So let us begin. I've got my units here in North Carolina. I've got my land units in Raleigh. I've got my air units in Fort Bragg. I have other units back at home. But again, you know, I just started building them and it's too late to bring them now and then these airborne and marine units uh it'll take a long time just to you know trek across central america mexico and some of the u.s states i had to make treaties of course uh, full transit treaties just to get through uh or just to get to virginia actually so i made treaties with mexico <laughs> new mexico texas wouldn't work as you can see Colorado then I had to go Kansas wouldn't work as well Nebraska and then Iowa and then down to Missouri then through Tennessee and then to North, North Carolina weird way right like look at this path you just go up take uh, go east still go east then go south then go east again and then you know you're there in Virginia so that was the plan and route that I did all right so let's get the show on the road guys to clear war in Virginia for the fourth or fifth time gosh dang it uh, let's see how this goes. Country versus state. Well, now it's a sovereign country since this is the shattered world. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, mm. I completely forgot about that. Again, Virginia has the largest naval base in the world. Uh, and a bunch of naval units. I think it has one of the most naval units out of all the states in Shattered World, I think. Oh, crap. They've got missiles loaded up in those Arleigh Burks and submarines, destroyers and whatnot. Crap. I forgot about that. Cuba is offering me all these units, but it's too late, Cuba. You could have done that. I'm rejecting your offer. You should have done that in the beginning of the video <laughs> when I needed your help. Let's go through here. Let's go through Danville. We got our first village. I'm going to put only one garrison in Danville. I've never been this far south into Virginia. The farthest south I've gone to Virginia is actually Virginia Beach. Pleasant place. Beautiful place. But that's the farthest south I've gone. So, again, I've only got 26 land units, I think. And most of these are just engineers and... Yeah, just engineers, actually. Hopefully this is enough, though. Oh! What? Oh! Oh! That's right! 
I'm looking forward to uh, trying to eliminate my state actually for some reason. I don't know why. It sounds wrong, but still. I want to get this W, you know. Alright, let's get this unit out. Look at those burst fire go. All that sound. They took Danville? That was my garrison! God damn it! <sighs> Always happens to me. And that tank is gonna get away. Let me go, let me go. Let's take Danville again. Stepping stone into Virginia. Six unit kills, eight unit losses. What? It feels like I got eight unit kills and they got six unit losses. Wait, what? I just mixed that up. No, it feels like I got more unit kills than them. That's bullcrap, dude. Alright, these anti-tank units are not working out well. So let's get them out. Did my artillery, my artillery units already got destroyed? Are you kidding me? Oh, what the frick, dude? Oh, that hurt. They've got air, I mean, not air units, but, well, they do have plenty of air units and artillery units in there. A bunch of missiles loaded up. Again, Virginia doesn't have, doesn't has, uh, they don't have the biggest military state-wise, but they do have a lot of missiles and artillery units and, of course, naval units. Let's not forget about that. I can't get through that, man. I'm going to have to go straight in, though. Oh, this sucks. What can these engineers do? Is that it? Did they run out? They did. That F-16 Falcon still has missiles loaded up. Oh, if, even if I get to the road. Shoot. Richmond is right there. They've got five garrisons, but they got so many artillery and air units that that could be the end of this versus with El Salvador. So, the best I can do is just take Danville. If it ended. If it ended. It hasn't ended yet, guys. But Danville will only be... The village that I have conquered from Virginia. The only one that I've, t I've taken over. Take these alligators. Oh, come on, man. Alright, can I take Takahoe? Maybe I could do that. If I can't take that nuclear factory, the coal factories and whatnot. If I can't get through Petersburg and Hopewell, then you know what? I guess I'll take Takahoe. Let's do that. See what happens. And I'll use my air units as well. Oh, what? Oh, no, 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 no. All right. All right. Um, where are my air units? Let's use that. Let's do it. I've got some. I've got two fighter jets and a helicopter. And, and an egg. That's right. I got two fighter jets, a helicopter, and an egg. How about that? got no egg. Can I at least take that? Come on. I want at least that factory. Oh shoot. Oh crap. Alright. You know what? Well, I guess we're heading back to Danville, huh? My air units got destroyed easily. Oh no, they're still there. What? They didn't even do anything. They ran out of fuel. That's what happened. Especially that Dragonfly uh, fighter jet. It runs out of fuel easily. Oh. Ow. No! You are not getting away. What? I'm on wheels, man. Oh, the sound is glitching. Too much. That's the problem with this sound effect. Okay, they, okay, they, they've got tanks, I, I see. You've got tanks, I don't. All right, you win, that's it, I give out, I surrender. It's a loss, it's an L, I get it. Jeez, stop. Peace. Come on, Virginia, I was just, it was, it's just a prank, bro, it's just a prank. It's just a prank, bro. Hey, it's just a prank. <laughs> that's what it feels like right now. All I can do is just, I mean, I did make, you know, I did make it all the way to Richmond, but all I did was just take Danville. That's all I did. But usually Virginia is one of the first states to fall every time. 
when there's a high volatility in this uh, campaign. Oh, they're coming in now. All right, okay, they're trying to kick me out now. They don't want me here. That's what they're saying. All right, Virginia, I see you. But there you guys have it. Uh, I'm gonna surrender right now, and I really can't do anything else with just five, six units, just because how many uh, how many missiles they have in their naval ships. Holy crap! Look at that. they deployed more naval units. Dang, that's incredible. But there you guys have it. It's an L, another loss. Again, if you guys missed the uh, stream for World Annexation Part 70, there's a link below if you missed it. If you're interested in Supreme Ruler 2020, there's also my personal link to G2A for Supreme Ruler. Cheap price, only a dollar, two dollar. Yeah, it's around a dollar for Supreme Ruler on G2A if you are interested in the game. And then I hope you guys enjoy the outro that I created at the end. And, you know, again, it's anime based, so hopefully you guys do enjoy the outro that I created. As always, Rebel Gamers, subscribe, like, and I'll see you guys tomorrow for some Yu-Gi-Oh! Gonna do a Kaiba into submission. Later, guys.